It's JP Hack. Hello everyone, I'm Pondon. We're getting right back into it. So I had a discussion with Pick yesterday about how bad I am at his game. And we changed, and what I decided to do based on our conversation is I asked him like how high of a priority is hard mode? And he said, not very at the moment. He said, I'm more concerned with getting a working normal mode than a dope hard mode. And I'm like, that is completely and utterly fair. And so I reduced the auto levels to normal mode status. And we'll see how that works out in my favor. So far, I feel like it's making a huge difference. Holy crap. I'm so powerful by comparison. The dodging, the one rounding, the wall thing. Let's go, LeBlanc. Yeah, so now we're playing on normal. We're playing, I basically, so for those of you who are wondering, like, how do you switch between one mode to the other? Um, it's really just a matter of adjusting the auto levels. So each chapter in your Fire Emblem Rum has a set of auto levels that can be applied to each of the different difficulty settings. And this is what is used or what's added depending on what the game recognizes as the difficulty. So in this case, because I started on hard, We can face tank with Rose. All right. So, pretty much, I reduced the auto levels to zero, so it's effectively the same as normal mode. The only difference is then between the two modes would be if there's any special events or additional enemies that have been added for hard mode. But given that Pick hasn't focused on hard mode as a difficulty, I don't think this is the case. So I think that this will actually simulate normal mode as close as possible for the next few chapters and you know what we just had to do it i was getting too beat up and he and i both knew that hard mode needed to change just with the amount of density that was there and all that kind of crap so look at oscar dude yeah normal mode feels just way easier Big strength. Yeah, it's pretty amazing just like what a few extra stats will do. Gotta play test, guys. This is why we're here. I mean, JP Hack is still very early in development. We are testing. Let's see. If I put. Yeah, then Wolf can. I like this play here with Sayori. Pilu. This is gonna be the run, lads. I can feel it in my bones right now. It's 5 a.m. I'm barely awake. We're ROM hacking. Finn can't double still. It's just like we're just like he's supposed to. Okay, spooky eyeball, spooky eyeball. Good. Okay, there's go hard and and gang. All right, so we're gonna do one. If only Gale Force could just go forever. And then... Oh, the strats, my guys. Holy heck. This is when Sayori became good. This is the precise moment where you saw Sayori become good. I'm a bit worried, because this, this like corner spot is deleterious to my health. Right, 
I don't want to pull any of these guys. I don't need to choke this point yet. You're under heat, though. So we're going to do some repositioning. We still gotta, we still gotta play this game like we cook our ribs, boys. We gotta do it low and slow. All right, let's see. I gotta give this to Brian. Yeah, I'll take the flank saver, Brian. Go, my son. Go forth. And then you go hard. Dodge, dude. When your armor knight's dodging, you know. Alright, this is all about. Yeah, sacrifice. I feel like it's like in Dragon Ball where they train with like heavy stuff on and they take it off and then they're like amazing at everything. That's how I feel right now. Look at the one round and go hard. She's unstoppable. Axe armors. I mean, I, to JP Hacker credit, I will say, I was scared of the Revenants. They are chunky. Okay. Arden taking an absolute beating, but he's okay. So many reinforcements, my god. Casual one hit. I'm actually gonna do this. Cause this needs to be the wolf show. I'm actually worried that I'm giving the wolf is actually stealing all the experience. But there's part of me that's like that's kinda just how you're supposed to play the game. Sanders the occasional kill. Brian's gonna get the occasional big experience. Oh, uh, Brian. Okay, Walt's gonna be under some heat here. These overlapping ranges. All right, let's see. This guy, a oh, vulnerary. I think I know what we need to do. Epic trade strats. Dude, I don't know how people play Fire Emblem without the rage trade. It just feels so essential at this point. I've been so spoiled by it. Low and slow loud. This map is spooky, and I like the layout a lot. I, and I kind of like that there's a lot of pressure. It's a very different sort of, like, go kill the boss map. Like, I'm really fighting through hordes of monsters to move forward and get positioning. And I kind of like that because I feel like a lot of times you can just, like, knife through. But there's a balance to be had because you don't want to spend too many turns in one spot. So, it's an interesting dilemma.
to say the least. I think normal mode will hit that balance better. <laughs> Go hard. Get a good level up, you deserve it. Skill, excellent. Okay, you do that. Can't give every kill to Wolf. Occasionally I have to give it to the Crimson Flash. Man, Sanders takes such a beating from this guy. Walt doesn't. I mean, if it gives Walt a full level, it's hard not to give it to him. There we go. There we go. Gale Force Walt. Can you even dream? stopping him. This is actually like a this is actually kind of crafty because of these eyeballs here. So I'm thinking Kind of stinks. I think I need to do my pure water strat once again. Because, yeah, Arden. Arden's gonna be under heat right now. The fly dude, flying enemies in water, such a good way to make choke points more exciting. Not enough games have like these like water with flight situations. I do need to move Riz out of the way. Water Oscar as well, just in case. Pure water, all the boys, why not? There we go. Good dodge. <laughs> the little wrap around. Arden should be able to tank. Well, he's only gonna get hit by one. Pure water strats, boys. Alright. Oh god. Oh god. There's no water. All the water's gone. This is Pig's allegory for global warming in one chapter. The political messaging is just too much. Alright, let's see. Okay, go hard here. Irons for Brian. Alright, so the key is getting Wolf into the fold. Strategy is how do I get Wolf where he needs to be? First, Wilbo's gonna snag a kill because she hasn't been doo doo the whole map. Magic. It's actually pretty good for you. Alright, let's see. Now, can you. Ooh, you're so close. Wolf can do it, of course. Of course, Wolf can do it. Alright, so let's. Yeah, we'll 
Heal up Arden. Don't like the idea of Oscar taking so much damage. This guy can just like waltz right in too. I'm not crazy about this. Can, how do these guys do against the eyeballs? Much better with pure water now. Yeah, let's do this actually. So we get rid of one eyeball. God, Walt is so good. Is Walt a god gamer? Let's see. <gasps> Harden can one around the eyeball. Let's go. The Madman. Get some defense, please. Okay, res. The full heal, though, that's clutch. I forgot about that. Galic time. Alright, now. I gotta say, man, with these hard hitting enemies, having that extra range damage, really, really nice. Okay, let's see. Ooh, Blanc takes beating though, that's actually terrible for her. Yeah, I don't need to expose you to all these guys. Alright, I need to make an epic wall here. So we're going to do this. Yeah, because now you're safe. Riz wants to take some damage, you can take some damage. Of course, Walt still has a full use Vulnerary because he's an absolute champion. I'm playing too aggressively and it's starting to unravel. Ooh, the dodge though! And the double! Arden! I'm so happy that Arden and Walt finally found their use in JP hack. Oh, Sanders might be dead here. Sanders dies, I'm going to be very upset. Oh, thank God. Normal mode. Normal mode. Is this half 1RN? Alright. We might actually have a chance here. That was the good luck. The game pitied me. Riz. Why are you running away? No. Well, I guess the green units are gonna come hang out with us. Wow, the green units know how to heal, that's so nice. I kinda wanna go deliver him back, but I don't think I have the capabilities. All right. We were blessed with another chance. Give this one to Otaku. We're just fiend cleaving everything. Let's see, how much damage do you do? 27. 
you have eight defense, which is 19. You'll actually, you'll die probably. Now, Sanders has to not suck. Gotta worry about this guy. He can't. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, he can't wrap around. Good. Heal up, Sanders. Now we gotta, this is actually not a terrible position for us to be in. We can actually maybe win the game. I wanna take this. How much heat are you under though? Sharp claw, many claws. We'll just, let, we'll just let Wolf do it. Yeah, we're gonna do this, I think. We're gonna Scissor Act here. What a power trio, Wolf, Arden, and Oscar. <laughs> Alternatively, yeah, let's face tank with Arden. I don't trust Sayori. Well, how much damage does Arden take from these guys? 11. Ooh, flat. I don't think that's a good idea, actually. Yeah, I think we might see Sayori here. He looms Sayori. I gotta watch out for that guy. Both still out of range. Okay. I'm gonna stay on the bridges just in case. And there's funky water shenanigans. Ooh, Oscar, don't die. Let's boost the defense. Excellent. That worked out super well. Normal mode. I like how Gohard's just dealing with the spiders by herself. It's fine. Man, if only I had an antitoxin. But no one ever. Okay. Rip. They. <laughs> Whoa! They're, they're relying on Dan Luck here. Wow! I can't believe that, that shouldn't have happened. They're taking after me, guys. They're just dodging with their healers. The AIs learn. They become sentient. And look at this guy just charging on ahead. Just abandoning his friends to deal with the spiders. Well, they're gonna learn the folly of their way with face tanking with their healers. Brian, it's a big kill. Steel blade kill, Brian. Gotta give that big experience to Brian. Speed. Brian's stats are actually not very good. I think I might just do this. Heal up. 
let go hard fiend cleave from the point and then everyone else is just gonna bail Thank you, Sayori, for softening this up for Wolf. Now, we can set up Epic Choke Point. Because that's how you play Fire Emblem. I'm a little worried about the North, but... Aha! The boss! Elder Bale. He stays still. Ooh, look at oh, the setup, dude. I actually really like that. Eighteen minus seven, so you're taking eleven and then twenty. 31. You just live, but this guy is just a sharp claw. Okay. Oh, wait. I have a strat. Yes. Yes. Wolf. I have a strat. It involves Wolf. Alright, let's see. Who has the key? You do. See how this goes, lads. Go hard! Oh, go hard almost died. But it's fine. Or the monster almost died attacking go hard. Look at Finn doubling. Rare sight. Speed? Yes! Yes, Finn. Hard's gonna be taking some serious heat. I hope that the poison doesn't kill Go Hard, because that would be really stinky. Okay. This healer, though. No! My strats foiled. Are they really gonna let Arches self insert die? Oh no. That could have been so bad. Oh my god, I'm such a doofus. I forgot there's no water. I got really lucky, man. You cannot misplay in JP hack. This music definitely captures my emotions right now. No, you should have come help move back to help me out. The AI just always takes the most opportunistic kills. Never with the right and glorious thing to do. Yes, learn. Good job, Virgil. Block reinforcements. Nope, doesn't work. God, I can't believe I would have died there. Don't die. Oh, yes. Speed ring. When held. Brian. Yes. Giving the Fiend Cleaver such a big workout. Let's switch it up. Good. Oof. Sanders. Thirty three attack. Nope. Can you reach? No, we're safe. We gotta get those chests, though, man. All right. Okay. Well, we're gonna see some over the bridge Walt strats here. Walt. 
Wilbel up close, getting the big experience. Two kills, two levels, two points of magic. All right, there we go. What are you packing? A steel lance, prepare to be doubled. All right. Plonk. With the guarantee, fighter bros doing their thing. All right, let's see now. think the boss stays still so this is just bolt food so we're gonna send Arden back just in case good very good go hard good go hard my elixir uses these guys are screwed but I believe in them but at least they're distracting the spiders. But we do need to hurry the heck up, because they are going to come for me very soon. Shall retreat then. This guy's going to go and freaking berserker charge the boss. Okay. I'm loving the anti-turtle, dude. The pacing feels pretty solid overall. The soft timer was pretty well placed. All right, all right, all right. Heck. Killer X, yes. Alright, so I wanted that. Can you take a hit from Mr. Silver X? 30? 12? Yes, you can. I don't really want to pull him if I don't have to. But I will prepare to pull him. Should I need to. Wolf's gonna just, like, work this guy. Now that you're blocking our zombie friend. When are we giving the spider two range? Alright, I'm gonna hold off turn. Him. You're staying so what do you do? You drop something. Ooh, ah, pick. The art of making me want to go for other things. Very good. Alright, let's see. Sarah will come down just to help all these guys out. And then alright. Go hard, Mr. Chance for extra experience. You know, we have to train Otaku. Good level. I'm not risking that. Can Brian block? No, Brian cannot block. So we're going to do this. Risk it all on an 88. This is 2RN. Do it. To our end. All right. Oh, now we get to see. Light brand man, go. Fight for your life. Oh, light brand man. Light brand man. For Finn. Okay. 
been doubling on six speed. Oh no, short bows with crit. Well, barely would have lived. Enemy phase gale force for Walt. Wow! Wow, green unit! Well, I guess I'll never find out what was in that last chest. That was one big spider. Looks like he was holding on to something. That was that was a really funny way to end it. The game knew. That was Pikmin helping me out hard. Oh, the Holy Land's Gungnir. I'm not sure you can make use of it yourself, but it'll serve you one of one of your allies well. You think something like that was down here? I can feel its power from here. In fact, it might be a little too powerful. With all these monsters around, it'll draw them right to us. We should be getting out of here. Right, onwards then. Gunier. Otaku, hey. Go hard, did you find it? Sure did, it's still in one piece too. Here, take it. Dot dot dot. Something wrong? Why don't you hold on to it for now? Eh, isn't this the scroll really important to you? It is. It's supposed to keep you safe if you hold on to it, so I want you to keep it. Otaku. The Dane scroll. Those mercenaries think I'd see them again here. And with holy weapons, no less. I'll need to think this over. Holy heck, we got through it. Um, what do I have to say about it? Really like the chapter. It's a hard chapter. It's not super unfair. I think the enemy placement is... This is probably some of the best enemy placement you've done, Pick, because there's a lot of good overlapping ranges, and it's making you check in different directions because it's indoors, but it's also very open. And so you got to check, like, north, south, east, west. Every time there's someone, like, max range. Like, when you're trying to bait an enemy, there's going to be another guy that comes, and it's going to put you in a bad spot. And I really like that. The soft timer with the red units was good. Um, it was really funny that that one green unit just decided to go rogue and kill the boss instead of helping me out. But it worked. We got through it. I got some insane luck, though. Like, I don't want to... Like, I should have died multiple times. Like, Sanders should have died. Marissa should have died. But I guess I paid for it by not getting boss experience. So, you win some, you lose some. But that was really funny. Anyway, guys, this is JP Hack, Chapter 6. I am Pondon. This is a hack by Pikmin1211. And I'll see you next time for Chapter 7. Four Wagon Wheels. Until then.